Turning now to politics and campaign 2015, dueling endorsements today. Latinos for Rahm Emanuel, progressives for Chuy Garcia, and that's not all. CBS 2's chief correspondent Jay Levine says there's a lot more going on behind the scenes. What's that, Jay? How about a political triangle, Rob, involving the mayor, the governor, and a suddenly popular newcomer? Get ready for March Madness. Let's start with the governor who's known to have close ties to both the mayor and uh, still on the fence, Willie Wilson. Willie Wilson's his own person. I don't know what he's going to do. He haven't mentioned to me anything about Mayor Emanuel. My suspicion is, though, that friend, um, I, I think the problem is possibility that it will come up. Rauner didn't actually endorse anyone, but he did criticize Garcia's relationship with the teachers union. I believe it should be illegal for anyone in elected office to take money from the people that they then contract with and negotiate pay from. We are all here uh, today to support Mayor Rahm Emanuel. City clerk Susana Mendoza was speaking for a prominent group of Latinos. In a time when there's the best chance ever for a Latino mayor you're turning your back on him. We would be shirking our responsibilities if we say, hey, we want this guy because he's Mexican or we want this guy because he's Latino, even though maybe he may not be prepared. To make this into an issue of race is just insulting to the electorate. It's insulting to me as a Latina. Garcia responded with a group of progressive aldermen. My candidacy represents a coalition, like I said repeatedly, multi-ethnic, multi-racial, uh, multi-geographic. And he blasted the mayor for another bond rating downgrade from one of three rating agencies. Two of them have said, recognize that hard work. Lawrence Massal from the Civic Federation, every budget recognized the hard work we've done in putting our financial house in order, making the tough decisions, and this is not the time to go back to the old politics that got us to the place that we were trying to clean up. The mayor, we've learned, will meet with Willie Wilson again tomorrow. So will Garcia, so will Rauner. As the suspense builds and the battle lines are drawn, as the countdown to the election five weeks from Tuesday continues. Clearly, they're all counting on Willie Wilson for support. All, I should say, would all like it. Willie Wilson said to me today, the person I endorse will win the election. I'm not sure if that's true, but the guy who, is, who got 50,000 votes with a low turnout could be somewhat influential if endorsements count. And perhaps he likes all the attention that he's getting right now. Everybody wooing <laughs> him, you think? <laughs> yeah, he, he's, he got into politics, and I think he's found he likes it. Okay, Jay, appreciate it.